Good morning, sunshines. Mori is paying us a visit. Aren't we lucky? I'm just telling Nona here how much uh, better he looks. I knew your visit would make a difference, dear. Uh, the Dracina didn't kill you then? Uh, Kai has been, uh, very helpful. Did you sleep okay? He doesn't want, uh, her to know that, um, we gave that to her. Did you sleep okay? You, uh, have everything you need? Uh, we're being positive today. Or every day. Yeah, it's pretty, uh, we are already firm friends, Mori, don't you worry. Oh, no, no, dear, it's wonderful to see you looking so well. Won't be long uh, until you can join me for another Tai Chi again. Anyway, time to be off. Stop by and see me in the stir fry at lunch if you get hungry, Kai. Bye bye, darlings. Oh, I'm sorry I interrupted you a little just now. Am I not supposed to mention it? Honestly, I didn't want to worry Mori. She's been very helpful to me over the years. But I have to... What is the noise that they're making for his voice, by the way? The clicking? What is that? Why is that? But I have to admit that her kindness is sometimes a little overwhelming. Can you join me? Uh, so you're fixed? Please sit. Can't thank you enough for helping me, Kai. The Dracino was exactly what I needed. I had some help. Your tea is getting cold. Okay. Now I am recovered. We must talk. Catch up. Um, ask about it again. Wait, so did the Dracino, like, fix you or what? Dracina. It's a step towards my being able to function again. While I may look like an old man to you, I do actually play a fairly important function around here. Why aren't you answering? Yeah, yeah, be straight, be straight. Why aren't you answering my questions properly? Sorry. I don't have time yet to dwell. You must spring into action. But what did it do? I have to share some things with you about my practice here as the community shaman. I want you to go to my hut in the crown of this tree and find my drum. Can you do that for me? Um, a shaman drum? Please trust me. I know words alone will not suffice. So if you get the drum, I can show you. That will explain things. Come back when you have it. In the meantime, we can't let your tea get cold. How about if I take care of that for you? I feel like I'm being drugged. Uh, sure. In the morning! Well, that was quick. I can't put that as its own episode. Alright. I uh, do like, uh, quite like, uh, tepid tea. My hut is a little messy, but the drum should be easy to find. Alright, he's kicking me out. Chapter 2! The Rooftop Garden! Okay, um... Fantastic. We're gonna go up there momentarily, but we're gonna take a look around. Because people are out and about. And I want to explore. Hey, look, this is open. Good morning, young lady! How's my old friend doing today? Um, better, actually. Wonderful. I could hardly believe Mori when she came down. I'm delighted that your visit is having this, uh, the desired effect. Now, what are your plans for the rest of your day? Why, do you have any good ideas? Yes, give me more stuff to do. Well, uh, I'll be in the archive again for much of the day. If you'd like to do any literary, uh, literary exploration. I'm dallying here awkwardly at the moment, waiting for Claire. She's supposed to help me to the archive today. But she's a little preoccupied right now. I don't like to interrupt. Ask about gardening. 
Oh, interesting you should ask. I'm just catalog cataloging a new compendium of common herbs and where to find them. Drop by the archive later. I'll see if uh, anything of use to offer. If I have anything of use to offer. Cool. Does that mean I get to start the gardening stuff? So many nice, chill places. Everything feels slower here. Yeah, that's that's a that's a good way to put it, isn't it? Okay. Hello. Shoe free zone, apparently. I have number three. Oh, I guess I'm getting a haircut. Am I? Feeling better? Aelin. That's her name. Aelin. What did I say? Alien? Oh my god. Uh, sure. Honestly, I don't know how you stand being covered in this stuff. It's all the same, really. Dirt, sweat, blood, sticky. Well, you look lovely and fresh now. Did you try the new fur-friendly conditioner? Yeah. I've been working on it with jelly. It's got milk fruit puree in it to smooth the follicles. Oh, it seems good. Is there much out there? Oh, don't know. Kind of a weird vibe. But you got something for the barbecue. Oh, sure. No worries. God, I want some barbecue. The baby was already hungry, thinking about it. Um, do I do I not get a haircut? No? Okay, fine. We'll get out of here. Um Let us head to the docks first. What was was there another bubble up here? No. Or let's talk to Jelly first. Guess it's hard to keep a cave clean. It's interesting, oh, they're back to work, that they have stuff like this that's been here the whole time, I'm pretty sure. But I wasn't allowed to inspect it until at this point. I feel like we may have been a little rash with the new Matrix. All matrices are rarely correct the first time. We all we do all this hard work, and what do they contribute? Still not sure that it's an argument for harnessing them for power generation. I like shoveling dirt. That's relaxing. You're right. We just need to uh, iterate. It smells good, too. Love the smell of a good pile of dirt. But that's the genius part. We set it up like a dot gym. Advertise it as an opportunity to get in shape and lose weight. That's a well-known concern of the dots, is it? It's, uh, an untapped market. Sometimes I have a nice roll around in it when nobody's looking. God. All I'm saying is, come on, let's just work. New mix is lovely. Maybe as a function of time? Yes, we agreed. How many of them are there? Is he not up yet? Julie seems to be a jazz fan. Groovy. What? Alright, well, I guess I can't interact with him. He shall remain. Give him his beauty sleep. Alright, now we're going to go to the docks. I think one thing that would be nice in adventure games... Where you tend to be in a room, right? And then you click an error, arrow going into the next room or the next area or whatever like that. And it'll auto-run you there, but double-clicking an arrow in some games, like Thimbleweed Park, will speed you to the next room. So if you double-click it, you don't run and then go in, you just automatically go in. And in the beginning of the game, you don't really need that because you're walking around and exploring. But once... You're in an, a smaller area, and, and this is a smaller area for a game, right? Um, it'd be nice to be able to jump around a little quick, because you've seen everything so far, and you just want to get into the story more. Wait, can I not talk to her? Oh, here we go. Oh, I guess that's not her. 
Houseboats are cool. Let's see her. What? Why do I sit on the dock over here to look at the boat, but I have to come over here to talk to him? Well, always nice to see your face to start the day. I guess I'm guessing it's because he can face the camera here, and they can have a. Okay, I guess that makes sense. Morning, Spike. You can feel it in the air, huh? What's that? Rain? Rain's on its way. Oh, but it doesn't make a difference to you. What you mean? Rain or shine, you always have your morning swim. Keeping records, are ya? Oh, no, I just, uh... I'm just pulling your leg, Claire. Oh. Well, it just seems like a nice way to start the day, that's all. Sure is. Watch out, I don't splash you. Oh, God, is he going to get naked? Oh, boy. <laughs> awkward. A little awkward, and he's just going to chill there. Um, I would not want to swim in this area. These waters are usually dirtier than most. When people are living on them. Who, who lives in there, I wonder? I can't wait till Tongue finishes his boat. I can't wait to... To get that scene. How about house is still not interactive? Tree house. Look how small the doors are. I wonder if those are, are the homes for the bugs that we see, right? Every now and again we see a bug in the sand here. We saw one here before. I wonder if this is their homes. Do they have homes too? Maybe they do. I like the soundtrack. You can get the soundtrack separately from the game on Steam. Remember, Steam made those changes? The, the way they had soundtracks was ridiculous. You couldn't buy a soundtrack unless you already had the game. It was like a DLC. Which is moronic. And the fact that it took them this long to fix that is also moronic. Um, but I, I believe it's completely fixed now. You could just simply buy soundtracks to games. And um, I'm enjoying this one. I like it. It's very relaxing. Can I, can I go up here at all? No, okay. Hello, Bebok, or whatever your name is. Is it, is it Bebok? Oh my god. Bopec! I was close. Oh! Uh, I, I thought you were someone else. Um, well, who are you waiting for? Uh, Jelly. But I just remember Jelly doesn't like the sun. I'll go visit at lunchtime. Does it dry him out? Um, I'll practice my jelly impression. Okay. Wait. I thought I was going to practice it right then and there. Did he catch something? No. Remember, we're doing all this before we get to the germ. Oh, did you have a nice uh, chat with your grandfather? Um, let's go. Let's start with hut, and hopefully we can go into drum later. Do you know where his hut is? Of course, just up in the tree crown. Though with uh, my gout, I find the way up there is something terrible. Oh. Grob's heading back to the mainland again today. I was just thinking if I might ask him to bring back a little chocolate. It's a secret ingredient in one of my stews. Don't tell anyone, though. Um, why does that have to be a secret? Everybody allergic to chocolate? Oh, it's just my stew is supposed to be 100% homegrown. No, I, I think I'll leave it this time. Perhaps until Garab is in a better mood. So what are you up to today? Um, didn't Grandpa tell you? Well, I may have uh, wheedled it out of him. It would be so wonderful to see some of Nano's gardens growing again. In fact... Oh! Here! These used to grow very well on his rooftop. Not much use except as an addition to salads. But the leaves have a lovely fresh scent. 
So I wonder if the instrument has anything to do with the gardens. Like, do you have to play music for the food to grow? Oh dear, I'm a little behind on prep. Alright, so she's telling me to get the F out. Sorry! Excuse me, chickens! Interesting that there's chickens all over. Also, is that a scarab? Look at a scarab. Um, doesn't Hawaii have an issue with chickens? Like, wild chickens? Like, being too many? The archive is closed. Hello! There's somebody out here hunting. I don't know if I would be around here. You triceratops-type creatures, whatever you are. Oh. There was something here. Wasn't there? Or am I crazy? Because I'm crazy. One of these days, Temple, you will give me content. What is that? Also notice that the creatures we saw early on in the game are no longer around. Remember we saw that deer-like creature, whatever it was, and this thing is new. So I don't know, uh, I don't know what's going on with that. Just checking to make sure it's not telling me to do something else as well. I think that's it for us, right? It's time to go, go grab the drum. Talk to him, we talk to them. I think I'm ready. Uh, can't go up there. Alright, let's do this. A new area! Hello! Breathe. Breathe. Good morning. I had thought my body language might communicate my desire to be left alone. Why are you disturbing my futile attempts at peace? Uh, Grandpa, Grandpa wanted me to get something from his hut. Did he? Did he now? Well, go on then. It's just there. Sorry. God. I'll take whatever that is. Yellow cap spore. There you go. Oh, look at The dots are up there doing something. They have spears. I will walk away. Golden palm seeds. Hobby, hobbleberry, hobbleberry seeds. Oh god, I can go all the way over here in this branch. Three shaggy beard seeds. That's the edge of the tree. Okay. Okay. Drum. Ah, oh, yuck! A dead bug. Is it is it blue? Is it blue? Maybe there's no TV reception in this house. Is that it? Is that all that's up here? What? So I was assuming the garden would be here. I don't see a garden though. I wonder if it's like up here. Oh, I can talk to these guys. Also, there's a hand here. Did I miss that one the first time around? Oh, I can climb. Tick tick, knit. Okay, okay, I'm going. Hmm. Alright, well, they're protecting something. I, did I really miss those? Okay. So we got his drum. Is he passed out? Uh, wake him gently. Time to wake up. Sorry, I must have nodded off. You have the drum? Oh, wonderful. Well then, let's uh here's our project for today. We're going to go grow we're going to grow a garden. Garden. I'm aware that might not sound immediately thrilling, but believe me, this is no ordinary garden. 
It's a special shaman garden? In a way, yeah. You see, I need something. Elephant fruit. It doesn't grow locally. It can only be cultivated. Um, why do you need it? Well, the juice of the elephant fruit acts as a tonic. Well, it helps sustain my recovery. Mutazioni, as you know, has a unique biome. You must learn about it. Pay careful attention to the composition of the garden. Why do you have to talk in riddles? Well, I cannot tell you everything, but I will tell you how to begin. There is a way shown to me by Mani to speed up plant growth. That's why I asked you to get me the drum. Ask a question. So it's a magic drum? The drum is normal. But when used in conjunction with a particular melody, we can speed up plant growth. I was right. So you want me to sing to a garden? I need to remind myself that this must be seem this must seem quite peculiar to you. But you need to be brave enough to trust me, to do things that might sound unusual. Uh, oh yeah, we're gonna be earnest. I'm sorry, I do want to help. Uh, Pacific Prelude. Okay. Garden Song. It alone does not make the plants grow. The drumming is what joins the circle between spirit, intent, and action. Oh, I nearly forgot. Here we go. Oh, elephant palm seeds. Cliff shrub seeds. Till I already got one of those, Grandpa. You will learn by doing. On the roof of this house, there's a small garden. These seeds will help you work out what the ideal composition for it is. And of course, you have the encyclopedia and Yoki to speak to. If you want more seeds, there are many to be found out and about around Mutazioni. Grandpa, I'm so far ahead of you. Be honest. I'm going to feel like such an idiot. I'm back later. Tell me about what you discover. Okay. And he passed out. Thank you, Grandpa. So this is my garden? Okay. Let's check it out. This guy's still chilling here. Rooftop garden. Okay. Plant seeds, grow songs, and listen. So let's start with seeds. I'm going to start with the... No compatible soil in this garden. Interesting. I'm going to start with the elephant palm. Pacific, acoustic, guitar, and soil. So if I click this, we'll not grow fully here. It grows well here, so I have to plant it in the middle. That's kind of weird. Incompatible soil, incompatible soil. Okay. So what would be the difference between growing it in this little plant and growing it up here? This is for a smaller plant then, because I can't grow here. It says, will not grow fully. Grows well. I think I'll start here, right? Why not? Okay. What else do I want to grow? Swamp? Is this a swamp? What do you mean grows well here? This is not a swamp, is it? Alright, anything else in here that I should care about I think um I'll focus on well there I'll focus on focus on Pacific airports needs more varied Pacific plants yeah varied I need to do varied vibrations and tree soil Grows well here. Okay, let's do that then. Swamp and soil. 
Okay, I'm just going willy-nilly right now. I just want to get started, right? Let's not goof around. Giant tree fern. Sure. I wonder if I could fit multiples in here. Let's try to fit multiples. <gasps> I can! Okay. What else am I missing? Cliff shrub. Like, can I grow mul- I can grow multiples. Okay. So, maybe I should do more elephant palms then. I don't have the room for it. Never mind. Oh, I have a second page. Oh my goodness. Tree... Um, grows well here. Tree soil there as well. All right, well, let's put one here. One there. You, I can put... There. There. Can I fit another? No. I fit two? No? Okay. Any others? These ferns, did I plant any of these yet? Oh my god. And I can't fit the elephant one in there. The elephant one only goes up there. All right, let's do this. This feels pretty full, right? Or no? It says needs more Pacific plants. I don't know where I would put them, though. Like, what do I put over here? What is this? What is this soil? Can't grow here. I want to know what kind of soil that is. Growth songs, tent plants. All right, let's do this. Pacific. Okay, that sounds lovely. So what does that what does that mean? Does that mean these are fully grown and these still mean more growing? Let's play it again. Okay. Oh, they were not fully grown. All right, let's play it a third time to see see these still have notes on it, but these do not. Does that mean these are finished? That's neat. Okay. Okay. So, 10 plants. What do I do here? Can now be harvested. Healthy, mature, harvest, move, or salvage. So click on that. Harvest? I got lots of seeds out of it. Can now be harvested. I'm just getting seeds. Am I supposed to get any kind of... Oh, I can't harvest that. Did I already harvest it then? 
Why did that one not grow? Uh, I kind of feel like there should be, like, harvest all, maybe? Like, I'm getting lots of seeds. Am I getting any kind of, like, fruits? Or I figured I would get something along those lines, right? Maybe? Needs more space to grow. Uh-oh. Okay. Plant is doing well here. It's not ready. I think I need to play another song. I think. Elephant fruit! There we go. So there, if it has fruit to bear, it'll be a, another section like that. Alright, let's play a... Um... Let's, uh, let's, let's grow some. Oh, the oh. Oh, so maybe maybe this wasn't producing fruit because it wasn't fully grown. All right, I think we're all done here. Uh, tent. This one. Only spores. This one also grew. Or was it this one? No? There we go. This one didn't grow for whatever reason. Maybe I put it too close to the edge. Okay, um, I don't want to spend a ton of time on this right now. I'm going to leave these guys go. I've got stuff, right? I've got lots of that now. And I got I got some of the fruit for Grandpa. Um, let's see if that will advance the time. If it will, I'll go I'll go talk to other people. It will. All right. So, I'm going to go explore until we go back to Grandpa with his fruit. Ho oh, hum. Wait. Did I advance the day from the last time I, ex I explored? Oh, I don't think I did. Did I? Okay, um, never mind then. We'll go advance the day. There's a caterpillar up here. Did you see that? Oh, there you are. How are things? Uh, be serious. What did I just do please don't fret my girl as old yoki would say there are more things in heaven and earth actually i think that's more there's more to that quote but he never finishes it um what does that mean it's a way of saying that there's more to life than anyone can imagine i'll show you more but you must trust me it's how i learned and how you shall too what are you teaching me? Now, do you have the fruit? Thank you, my girl. I'm proud of you, if you allow me to be so. I'll make a fine tonic from these. It'll stabilize my recovery. Don't you tell me anything? It's not so simple. I used to have a mind like yours, always hungry for information, unbiased data. Do you know I used to be a scientist? Um, if mom told me, I guess I forgot. Well, I, I was of no consequence. I arrived here as a scientist. Very quickly, my conventional science was deeply challenged. But what I learned and what I wish to pass on to you is the truth that knowing is a process, not a product. That, um, makes sense, I guess. It is personal, relative. The garden that you just planted is the first I ever grew in Mutazione. Gaia was barely a toddler. So energetic, chasing after Claire, 
or playing with the dots, the creatures who live in the tree crown. We had come from a cramped apartment in the city. And as your grandmother began her much more respected and important research, I played with Gaia in the mud. What was mom like? Oh, such a brash, clumsy child. Strong and fierce. So at the beginning, I only gave her weeds to play with. But the second the baby plants were in her hands, she softened in a way I hadn't seen before. We planted them carefully, together. Time was so precious. I see those moments in Toby sometimes. Huh. <laughs> Bundles of delight and frustration. I'll mash these into a tonic now. But you must know, you have done no small thing here today. No small thing. Thank you. 